This week's cover is about working conditions for graduate employees, commonly referred to as GEs. The Graduate Teaching Fellows Federation, also known as the GTFF, raised concerns to Yale administration regarding COVID-19 safety policies for GEs and faculty. The first photo I considered was a GE Liz Fairchild, who is the Vice President of External Relations for the GTFF. This is a very detailed up-close shot of her. With our push to put people on the cover, I thought this was great. I did find that her face was large on the cover due to the sizing of the frame, and also it didn't have as much of an indication of what the story was about. Something else I've been trying to change at the Emerald is moving away from just headshots and showing people in action on the cover, or some other way to show the setting or context of the story. I really like this photo, but knew we had others that may provide more of that story, so I went with another one. The next photo I considered was of Rajiv Ravasankar, who is the president of the Graduate Teaching Fellows Federation. He is working on a computer inside. It's not a headshot, so the action shot of him working is nice. I like the headline placement at the bottom, so the room for design was really good with this photo. I added an arrow to see how that looked, and I really liked it, but I just used a similar one on a weekend guide cover, so I didn't want them to look too similar. I ended up not going with this photo because it was a little darker and the outside photos had great lighting. The photo I ended up going with also had more visual components related to the GTFF that I thought would be nice to add to the cover. I ended up going with a photo of Liz Fairchild standing in front of a window. There are signs for GTFF and SEIU, which is a Service Employees International Union. I really like that you can clearly see the subject as well as the signs. There's one talking about striking which tells a small story of past GTFF movements. One thing I was hesitant on with this cover was that the subject's feet were cut off due to the frame size of the cover photo. However, I think this was a great shot of the subject that also goes with the context of the situation, so I think it was great regardless. With this cover, I was also able to play around with the headline and make it a little different than usual. I made the font different sizes to add variety and put emphasis on the unsafe conditions for GBs. I also made it the color of the subject's skirt. I added slightly transparent white boxes to make the letters more visible. I think this cover represents the story well because it shows signs from the GTFF, which people have likely seen around campus, and it also features a real GE on the GTFF executive board. I hope when people see it, they recognize the GTFF signs, the subject, or just read the headline and understand the conditions and lack of safety that GEs are facing.